Tourism is vital for the National Park, and we only really found that out during the foot and mouth outbreak of 2001. When people weren't here, we began to realise that visitors are essential for local businesses. The post offices, the shops, the pubs, the cafes, even the farms which are diversified into accommodation provision. Tourism can have negative impacts. People can destroy the very thing they've come to see. But that's the job of a national park, is to kind of draw together those special qualities and conserve and enhance them and promote opportunities for people to come and understand and enjoy them. And at the same time as we're doing that, the 1995 Act gives us a third duty. We have to take care of the socio-economic needs of the people who live within the park. So we have to do that in a way that embraces all three of those areas. That, in essence, is good national park sustainable visitor management.